down to go. <laughs> Whoa, look at this cute little flower. Good morning, everyone. Right now we are in front of the Polson House, which is a historical landmark, and it's about 126 years old, built in the 1800s. Pricey, but it's very pretty, super blue, and sometimes if you catch them having an open house, you can walk through it, but not today. But today we have a pretty packed itinerary. We are going to the west coast and we're going to see the Haystack Rock. There's this huge rock in the middle of the ocean and then we're gonna hike up Neokani Mountain. So those are the two big plans for today. We are walking to the world's smallest park. I think it's called Mills Bend. I don't really know the name, but it's a small little tree. It's so cute. 152 inches of square inches. <laughs> That's so tiny. 24 inches in diameter. Oh wow. wow, weddings and other celebrations have taken place here. There it is, right there. It's so small. Wow, look <laughs> at that. the haystack rock now a huge 200 plus foot rock finally made it in the middle of the ocean and i don't know if you guys can hear me but it's so cold and windy right now and this is one of the spots that chuji really wanted to go to <laughs> what does it feel like actually seeing it in real life now uh, it, it's much bigger than i thought it would be even on camera i feel like it doesn't look as big, but you just have to experience it in person. Uh, this thing's humongous. Yay, and a little fun fact, there's a lot of tufted puffins that fly all around it and just nest and breed there. There's so many. The sun sets this way, and we've seen a lot of good pictures, so let's we'll see what it brings. up Niakani Mountain and the views are amazing. We're not even halfway there, but the views are already amazing. We're already high up. I think this is around like 2,500 feet in elevation, but the views compared to yesterday is a lot different since it is the ocean and it's a lot more jungly. The trail, it is not spread out wide open in the forest. Like there's a lot of vegetation around us while we're hiking. So we're gonna get a cool drone shot. So easy to shoot. Are you ready?
do food reviews and hike reviews. Yes, Rate hike review. Hike. hike review, this hike is already easier than yesterday. I'd rate it 5 out of 10 challenging. And, the, review, and the views are very worse. Yes, love the jungle forest vibe. <laughs> and Chuji said it's more engaging. Yeah, I mean, you lose motivation, you just look to the left. And well, then you got the, the ocean. Yeah, exactly. All right, let's keep hiking. It's all falling down. Two hours later. Okay. This is the viewpoint. Is it really? Yeah. Oh, yeah, it is. Dude, what? <laughs> this looks like a painting. <laughs> what the heck? We just hiked up this mountain. We were down there earlier. That's crazy. Wow, what happened? What do you mean? The battery. What the heck? That was on its on the last five percent before it just drops out of the sky. And I got Choo the shot. Oh I my got the God. shot. We made it to the tip of the mountain. Oh my gosh, look at this. So <gasps> Yeah, this view is insane. We are sitting on top of a bunch of rocks, lots this is steep downhill, <gasps> so we're trying to be like super still. Wow, we climbed this whole mountain. That's crazy. <laughs> The view of the Pacific Northwest Coast. It's so still up here. We got a bunch of rocks. Have to climb that back down. Wow. This is something you just have to experience in real life. Like this video does not, like I don't even know. It's not the same. Yeah, there's no one up here besides us. Or there were some hikers in front of us. We don't know where they went because we thought they'd be up here because they didn't pass us on the way down. So maybe they went a different way. I don't know. But, wow, we are here. We're on the way back now. The sun is setting. Look how beautiful it is. Golden hour at 8 p.m. Keep on going. Bye. We're back in Portland near Beaverton and we're eating at Ringo's, which is like a bar and grill place for dinner. It's super late at night. This was like one of the only places that it's open this late. It's around 11 p.m. right now. But we just ordered some cheeseburgers and we don't expect too much out of it, honestly, since it's a bar. Um, I think this place is known for their beer. They have a ton of beer on tap, but we didn't get any because we're super tired and we got an early flight to catch tomorrow morning. Just wanted to give you guys a quick little update. This trip has come to an end but it was, it's been so fun and we've done so much today. This trip is definitely one to remember. I'm so glad that me and Jack filled our days with just so much activities and so glad that we got to bring you guys along as well. That's a lot of tots with the heck. Jack got some beer. I'm gonna take a small little sip. I don't even like beer. Passion fruit sour ale. It's based on... Uh... Oh wow. It is like kombucha. 31 IBU. That's actually Tropical good. tart, crisp. I like it better than regular beer. Yeah. It's based, it's based, it's from the beer, so. Oh. Yay, food. Not bad. 
bad. Her car food is good. Uh-huh.